It was respected, very, very respected and loved. Did I ever have a tougher opponent? No. When you see him play, it's what a player. He was one of the players that I really looked up to. He was a star, a huge star. He was my hero and I'd be in awe of him. Without question, he was the best captain I ever had. I was playing for the school team when I was 12 year old. I just felt I oh, maybe he's got a chance of being a footballer. I think it was quite clear from an early age what a talent he was. Once you saw the real Brian Robson in midfield, there's nothing better. Signing him for me was the best bit of business man United had ever done. There was no one looked like they were representing that shirt better than him. When I got given the captain's armband, Manchester United fans saw the real Brian Robson playing. As they say, the rest is history. It became a, a sensation going forward. He was the outstanding player in the league. For us youth team players, we were in awe of Robbo and everything that he did. He was always destined for management because of the leadership qualities he had. If you ask Middlesbrough fans now about some of the great players that they had, they'd name that team for him. That achievement to keep the baggies in the Premier League, phenomenal, really. The specialist said, Mr. Robson, I'm sorry to say, but that looks like a cancerous tumour to me. Which was a massive shock, obviously. People in the northeast of England, they have a mentality of never giving in. He had that as part of his character. see why people talk of him as the greatest captain for United and England. With Brian, you felt, that's how I'd play if I had those gifts. And he was a captivating midfielder. He is not just a leader, he was a punt of the leaders as well. And to be the leaders of the leaders, I think Brian was the leaders of the leaders. <laughs>